I'm going to show you how to make a spring fresh kale flour salad. First, put a little bit of oil in the pan and begin to heat the oil. Next, take some fresh ginger and a grater and start to grate the ginger into the pan. And you want to use a fair amount. As you're cooking it, sometimes the flavor will dissipate a little bit and a lot of ginger brings out the flavor of the kale nicely. Once you've got enough ginger in there, then you want to get a fresh clove of garlic. And I like using a garlic press because that way the flavor of the garlic spreads throughout the dish. And let that cook for a little bit until it starts to heat up. And then add in your kale flowers, lots of things like the kale flowers, and start cooking those until they start to get a brighter green color. And you probably need to stir them around a little bit so they don't burn on the bottom. And you want to get the ginger and the garlic well mixed in there as well. And keep stirring and stirring. And you can cook this for a long time and have greens that are very well cooked or you can just saute it for a short period. And my favorite is to do a short period. If you do it for too long, I th think the greens get kind of limp and to me they don't taste quite as good. Put a little soy sauce on and then stir that in. And then after about two minutes, you're all ready and you've got a nice, fresh, healthy dish to go with potatoes or go with a nice piece of chicken or whatever you're looking for for a nice spring meal. Okay, then you're going to put it in a bowl and it's all set and it's ready for the table. You can garnish it if you want as well with flowers or chives or onions. And then you can get back outside to the flowers. The hellebore, the crocuses, the daffodils are all just beautiful this time of year.